What is up, everyone? This is Justin, a.k.a. FMDG, and I'm here with episode number 17 of Chandler FC, A Race Up the United States Pyramid. Form's awesome. We just went through the transfer window. Not really a lot happened. Um, but, yeah, I mean, I don't know. We'll see. We are playing number two today, so uh, it's kind of a big match. Wanted to come back for that. All right, guys, welcome back. As you can see, still number one. Move that out of the way. My head's not in the way. Okay, good. Um, we are 12 points up on Hartford. Also 12 points on top of uh, Austin, who's in third. But we did the other day clinch playoffs, so big deal. Congrats. That got some promises um, or one promise made. Uh, let's see. Finances are still in disarray. Um, yeah, so let's see, where did we leave off? Uh, yeah, well, okay, uh, John Brown we brought in from loan from Memphis. I think you were here for that. Um, as far as guys leaving, um, Garlic is off on loan. I just wanted to offset, I'm trying to offset some uh, salaries. And Cheng Mu um, had a couple teams come after him. I tried to tell him no, and then... As it was happening, it was like a couple days before the transfer window. Um, I decided to put him up, but put a 40% uh, 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 whatever uh, sell clause on there. So I'd get 40% of his next sale. And immediately the next after I hit continue, he had signed with Miami for um, end of contract. So that kind of sucked. I was able to, so I'm like, well, if he's gone anyway and he's never going to play for me, I might as well try to sell him now. So, unfortunately, I couldn't get the sell on um, clause on there for 40%, but uh, was able to get 500 bucks and I don't have to pay his salary anymore. So, to me, that's kind of a win. Uh, finances are, you know, we're just barely above payroll. Um, did lock up Flores on a new contract. Uh, let's see, what's he got? He is up to 650, so he's making the big bucks. But I did lock him in for one more season. Um, wanted to get him before any of the big teams came in chasing him. But um, form's been pretty good. I believe we left off here. Followed up with a 2 2 draw against PD Academy. Flores again doing bits. Um, and then we haven't lost, we haven't, we've won every game since. Uh, Flores getting a Hattie here against Memphis, um, against San Juan, a 4 0 win. Scott Gallagher Metro, this was fan day, so I was kind of looking forward to see what we could do there. Get a 2 1 win, bring in about another 100 people we didn't normally bring in. Um, didn't equate to much because when Lone Star came in for the next home game, we only brought in another. You know, was it 12 more than the last home game before uh, fan day? So, yeah, we got a win against BlackRock 1-0. Uh, Lone Star Academy 2-0 win. That's that's That was big. And then Vardar, the last one, 2-1 um, win. Uh, Cruz coming clutch at the end. You know, we had the lead most of the game. Uh, gave it away kind of with 15 minutes left. Uh, looked like they were going to salvage a point out of it. And then Cruz doing Cruz things. So today we're going to go up against Hartford, who's number two in the league, and then West FC Westchester, who's 16th. Um, looking at our future schedule, we really don't have a hard time. I mean, look at this. We're playing 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, and then 8. So we really don't have much else to do. Um, you know, Then we play some kind of mid-to-top table teams. So, um, yeah, we don't... It's looking pretty good for us. I don't know. I mean, gee willikers, what do I do here? So I wanted to come back for this game, and then I'll try to come back for when we can clinch it and um, for next time. But, yeah, let's let's get into this one. Um, John Williams did break his arm. Um, I was debating what to do. I could have put him in a cast, but didn't really want to spend the extra $1,000 um, to do that. Both teams are in awesome form, so this should be a fun game. Uh, we'll see. But let me make sure I haven't... Uh, yeah, everything should be good. I said that before. Um, I do want to get... 
I don't know why my assistant keeps doing this. I do want to get Puentes in for Giles because he's got a little bit more versatility on the back line. We're going to go with Novotny in goal, Nance, Riley, Perea, Mohamed back line, Valdez and Cruz in the middle, Madison Cantu on the wings, and Stewart behind Flores. Um, I think there was a change we had to make. Oh, yeah, because Williams was out with the, with the uh, broken arm. So, yeah, he has to come out and kind of messed up some of the uh, some of the love we had in here. I think, actually. Yeah, let's go with this. This is more of our tried and true. Uh, I forget my assistant a couple games ago switched this off when I had a couple of um, guys sick. Um, so I let him do that and then never went back. So, yeah, let me look at. I don't want another advanced playmaker. What can you play? Midfield. Okay, we'll do that. Put you in as playmaker. On attack good okay let's get into it if you guys haven't already subscribed to the channel I would really appreciate throwing me a subscribe it really means a lot um, also hit the notification icon next to that because you will be notified when I do post a new video and as always smash that like button um, need this need that I mean, so the, the smash and like button obviously the team can tell right that's how the uh, YouTube FM20 metrics work. When you smash a like button, it goes straight into the game. And uh, see, I can tell no one smashed it yet because they're all still composed. They're not jolly. Oh, he's getting a talking to. Good. Give him a, give him a red card. Okay, we will take free kick. Cantu on the right side, looking far post. Perea with his first goal of the season. Well done. That was awesome. I don't want to see this one again. Let's see, he's going to get there, get his head up. Oh, he, not head. He just flicks it in with his foot one time, catches it midair. Well done, Perea, with that one. That has to feel good, especially in a big game. I mean, this is the biggest game we got left of the season. So let's get it going. Okay, they're a little bit apprehensive. Let's tell them just to get creative, see if that helps. No, it doesn't. Basically the same thing Cantu looking for. Oh, Perea was getting there. Morin's like, no, 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 no. I'm not letting that happen. Oh, look at that. A header actually to one of our players. Nance looking for Cantu. Cantu looking. Stewart over to Valdez to Cantu. Just kind of tries to cheese one in there. Doesn't make it stick. They have a free kick. Ooh. Ooh, that was good. That was a good one. That was... Kind of that's a tit for tat there, kind of what we just did to them with the um Perea goal. I mean should be stopping that, should be stopping that. Okay. Let's go, boys. Perea with the free kick. Flores down, get there. Oh, what a stop by the goalie. Oh, was he offsides? Let's demand more. Focus them. Excuse me, I have to drink some water. All right, 1-1, one, one. Um, winning everything we need to be winning. I'm going to tell him assertively. Keep it up, result will come. Yes, because they listen to their gaffer. All right, let's go. Let's go out and get something. Get some points. I don't really know what can happen. I haven't seen anything, and I haven't done the math. If we got a guy. Oh, there we go. Oh, someone got taken down. Flores, come on. Come on. We, we got this. Get us those points, Flores. Right at the goalie? Come on. Are you kidding me? 5-7. Man, you miss a PK in this game, and it really messes with your rating. I guess I'll take him out. I mean, I'm out for Gebhard. Get him some uh, chances. Nance is looking pretty bad. I might do a two for here. Okay, we'll do that. Ah, that really sucks. Okay, let's uh, throw some demand more at them. If that works. Some, maybe. Okay, maybe not. Come on, guys. Throw some passion. Let's go. Okay, good. We got to throw in sports. Gets it up. Cantu! Oh! Thought he had that. I thought he had that. Okay, let's make one more sub. 
Madison's going to have to come out for Edwards. Okay. All right, they got to throw in Wheat. Better not lose this game. Ooh, that was a kind of a crappy header. Okay, keep it. Come on, let's go. Push him. Good. Okay, Stewart over to Valdez. Tons of space over there for Cantu. Oh, just missed it. Okay, we got time to reset, except we can't be heading it to their guys. Who, seriously, who are we sending the ball to? All right. As long as they pass it back. Oh, look at that Valdez. I swear, if we manage to steal one here, I'm going to be so impressed. Correa just lobs it up for nobody. Riley is going to have to collect that one over to Schwartz. And that's the game. Ah. We should have had that one. We really should have had that one. Yeah, I knew I knew that wasn't going to go over well. But I feel like we had every chance and just blew it. <laughs> Did you fury? That's right. Okay, let's get in for the next game right after this. All right, guys, we are back. Um, I forgot I had shortlisted someone. It's a weird. Uh, he showed up in my uh, scouting lists um, when I was trying to find guys of certain uh, nature and whatnot. I had a familiar face if you watch my other series, which, which you do, right? I mean, yeah. Um, but we brought someone in on trial, uh, Colin Helmrich. Um, he's only two star, so I basically just brought him in just to bring him in. And he won't be part of our team and i'm sure he'll expect too much money but kind of was excited to bring him in because of the love but yes you follow my other series which you should he was a he's a big part of that um but let's get in with the game same exact lineup as before novotny nance riley perea mohammed valdez stewart in the middle madison Cantu on the wings Cruz and flores in the middle ready to go yeah nothing else happened um which is good. No news is good news. Um, I do notice this weird green thing with me wearing my super red shirt. Um, I know not all of you are from America, but uh, you know we just had Super Bowl a couple few weeks ago, and I did grow up a Chiefs fan, so um, yeah, wearing the the Chiefs garb today. Uh, let's encourage the team. I'm gonna let the assistant handle that because I screwed up the last talk, but apparently he did okay. Let's go. Okay, they got a free kick. Wow. Holy crap. What was that? Wow. Um, that was quite a kick. Jeez. I don't know what Novotny was doing there. Oh, he was onside. I'm going to yell at them, show some passion. I mean, this is a 17th rank or 17th team in the league. We should be beating the snot out of these guys. Can we, how about not? How about not do that? Hey, these guys are coming to play today. Holy cow. Nance is throwing to Madison. Let's, let's show these boys who's boss four minutes in. Stewart with it. Stewart looking for options. Sees Cantu on the right. Over oh, back to Stewart. Looking, they're not doing bad. Mohamed de Perea. Flores to Cantu. Stewart, Stewart, just a bit high. We might have to play some weird uh, moving around and doing, doing tactic stuff, which is not my forte. Um, I'm going to yell at them to get creative. Good. Because, yes, we do need some love on that end of the field. Get creative again. I should demand more. We should be beating the snot out of these guys. Where are they? 31, 33 points. I mean, come on. Okay, let's go. Push some pressure on them. There we go. There we go. Just possessing the ball. Move it around. Find the open man. Let's go. Stewart over to Madison. Looking to cross it in. 
Oh, Miles of Space Cantu. There it is. Sean Cantu. Goal number nine of the season. Assist from Darius Madison. All day, every day. That is what we do here. Chandler FC. A little sloppy there, but <laughs> I think he just killed that guy. That defender's ankles are shattered right now. Good. Okay, let's give him a little bit of praise after that so they don't feel like I'm such a monster. I've overwhelmed a couple of them, Cantu being one of them. They have a throw in. Oh. Let's get it. Mohammed gets it over to Valdez. Good. Flores. Oh, one time, one time, one time. Oh, hits the post. God. And Flores is not having a good run of games here. He was doing well. And then I start, decided to start recording, and uh, it all went to belly up. Stewart, come on. He's running. I need someone to come with him. Ooh, I guess I don't. Evan Stewart, third goal of the season. He does it all by himself. If no one's going to help him. He's going to handle it. Well done. Well, at least that doesn't shatter him. Okay, good. This is what we need to be. Took us a little while. Assertively say, pleased with how things are going. Everyone's in decent shape. Madison might need to be the first one out, but we'll see. All right. These are going way better now. What are we doing fitness wise? Madison's sitting on a 73. Okay, let's get him out of there for Gebhard. His natural position. Anyone else? Muhammad's at a 6'6. Six, six. Not the best. Can't do it with a free kick. Get in there. Cruz! Thought it was Nance, but it was yellow card. Cruz getting it done. Um Cruz is another one during the transfer time. I had some teams coming for him, and I kept telling him, no, no, no. He never got upset. I did offer him a new contract. Honestly, I don't remember if he's accepted it yet. Um, that might be one of the reasons we're over budget. I know Flores had the new big contract, too. This, this is good. We need, we need these points. I mean, we don't need them. I mean, oh, oh, oh. What a stop, Novotny. He, he'll kick himself for missing that. Yeah, I thought that was a for sure goal. They have a corner. Santos coming in near post. Riley's there to get it out. Good. Keep blocking him. Keep pressuring him. Push it back. Good. Make him push it all the way back to the half line. We have a free kick. Cantu takes it. Flores just a little hard on the head there. Nance has been booked, so yeah, let's tell him to calm down. In fact, let's let's bring him out for Schwartz, and Cantu can come out for Edwards. Protect that yellow from being a red and being in trouble. Santos with the free kick. Novotny fumbles it around, and they end up scoring. Don't make me regret these changes now. Oof. It's like 52 guys right there, ours included. End it, end it, good, okay. So they scored it, start the game and to end the game, okay, fair enough. I'm gonna let him deal with that, good, he just pissed off for Nance, I was like, Fernandez, he didn't even see the game. All right. Well, not too bad there, I mean, we're still, 12 points ahead of Austin in third. Uh, looks like Hartford kept up with us. They beat Beachside, which isn't a hard thing to do these days. So where, let's see, we got uh, nine, nine matches left, so that's 27 points. Um, so we can't finish any worse than fifth, it looks like. Um, we need to play a few games. I'll come back for the clincher whenever that happens to be. I'm guessing it will be somewhere in this realm, San Diego. I mean, hopefully it gets against one of these more difficult teams, so at least it makes it makes a fun match. But anyhow, we'll come back for that. All right, guys, that was episode number 17 of Chandler FC, a race up the United States Pyramid. Um, 
not really what I wanted to see. I wanted a couple more points, but hey, I'll take it. Four points in two matches is good. Um, and, you know, we're hopefully winding our way down to winning the least promotion, if not the title of the league. But if you haven't subscribed, please consider throwing me a subscribe down below. Hit that red button and smash the like button. Tell me what you like uh, in the comments. I really appreciate you guys. Thank you so much. Have a great rest of your day.